This room is a disgrace. That's why I like it so much. My Christmas explosion. I briefly thought to myself, man, get dressed, but then I thought, <laughs> These are clothes, so I'll just continue wearing them. And I'm going to show you some of my presents. And I want you to know that I am absolutely bragging. I'm going to show you this first thing that is literally the best thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Framed artwork of me. I'll invite you to stop it. My sister messaged the artiste and got it framed. So I'm utterly thrilled with that. That will be going in place of Tom Brady. Sorry, not sorry, but this is my room now. I'm going to try and tidy as I go. She lied. Oh my god, we're doing it everyone, we're doing it. Now, this doesn't actually count as a Christmas present because it was a birthday present, but my birthday is very close to Christmas, so whatever. My mum got me Phantom of the Opera record. So it's, I don't actually have a record player, but it's a bloody collectible, don't you know? Look at that. I mentioned I like musicals, but how gorgeous is that? I want to display it. I want a record player now. Flipping love Phantom of the Opera. I'm so far failing to actually put anything away. This little hamper, vegan beauty skincare from Cachito, 100% plastic free, which I was, I'll be honest, suspicious about because, but apparently it's not plastic. So this is what it came with. How cute, a vegan handmade soap, a 20 pound note, it's not. Floral lip balm, oh my God, there's leaves in this. This is literally adorable. A shampoo bar. I love a shampoo bar. Oh my god, it all smells incredible. Handmade deodorant. Jeez Louise. And a bath bomb, OFC. And can you appreciate the leaves? Are you kidding? Look at the leaves in there. I'm gonna ruin the ambiance. She said autumnal. She said fall, cause leaves fall down. Yeah, that's flipping adorable. 10 on 10, big fan of that. I like to keep bags and postal things because they're very, very useful. I refuse to buy an envelope. Who does that? Next we have this book. I'm gonna see if 2022 is the year that I read something. She Thick, How to Save a Life, Eva Carter. A heart stops, their story starts. Wonder if there's any tips for work in this. No pictures, sadly. Let's put that up on the shelf. We're doing it, lads. We're putting things away. most annoying thing about all of this is I'm not actually that chaotic. This was a little mini present. My friend Will make Christmas crackers each year for his friends and family and he put some Eucerin Aquaphor in mine because it's my absolute favourite. Oh my god I'm gonna do it. Focus on the Aquaphor. It is marketed as a skin balm but it's too greasy for me personally so I just use it on my lips. Favourite! I've got lots of Tony's Choco Lonely. Delicious. Gingerbread and candy cane. Be happy. Grow your own sunflower. Disc of, of sunflower ingredient. Everything in this house is barely alive, so I'd like something that was actually alive. Macrame event. The sunflower inside of, and I will hang this from somewhere and it will be cute and adorable and wonderful. So I'm very thrilled about that too. Recycling. Now one of the things I asked for this year was fluffy socks because I like sleeping in socks. And I'm not afraid to admit that. We were inundated, which is excellent. Some that I'm currently wearing. It's got little ears. That's adorable. Totes, toasties, bed socks. I'm glad they even say bed socks. Excellent. And then my mum, I asked for oven gloves because my oven glove is looking a little bit worse for wear at the minute. And so she got me this very cute sort of little pot thing. Or you can put hot things on it. And it matches. Cute. Oven glove. Doth it have a label? Doth not. Oh my god, it fits. And then my mum also got me this other oven glove, which I'm a big fan of. Blue Q oven mitts. 5 pm me. I love cooking. 7 pm me. F this. How flipping cute. Again, yes, a perfect fit. Oh my god, it's more socks. We love socks. Little penguin socks. <clears throat> From Jewels. Look at the length on them. Gorgeous. I'm making a little pile of socks behind me. Isn't that great content? Would you believe it? It's more socks. But how adorable is this though? Look. Oh. Whose hair is that? Sweet freedom, Mr. Bunny. We got a little tail. Another thing that I got downstairs I can't be bothered to show you is reusable silicon baking sheets to avoid the use of parchment. I got this rainbow scratch off colouring book from my mum. We practice mindfulness in this household. Will it fit on the shelf is the question. It's domestic bliss. Of course, the Cadbury's selection box. Very important gift to receive in the holiday season. Some of these are stocking gifts. 
toothpaste. Took that one personally. Oh, this is from my sister. So this is a necklace and it's got a rough edge to it and you can soak like olive oil onto it. It's both to invigorate your senses and Lord knows I need my senses invigorating. Toothbrush. My mum wants me to brush my teeth. I brush my teeth, mum. Then my mum got me this adorable Christmas decoration. Look, it's gingerbread doctor. That's about how shapeless I look in the uh, scrubs as well. My mum did us no. Father Christmas did us our stockings. Some more smelly pigs, wax melt. Bloody love a wax melt. Obviously some chocolate buttons. Another shampoo conditioner bar. Lovely. Of course a Kinder Bueno. A lot of confectionery. And then we've got banana body wash. An apple, obviously. Very cute penguin soap. Club penguin, look. Some hand cream. We always love a cream of the hand. Some more socks. The world's most expensive chocolate. Or so I thought as a child. Ferrero Rocher. Smarties. Christmas Smarties. An orange for vitamins. Mum's not messing around. She says, look, I will give you a metric ton of chocolate. And I will also give you this. This very adorable little bag. Oh, look, isn't that lovely? What a it grows and it's got a sturdy bottom, that's what he said, to allow it to stand upright when it's got things within it. Isn't that fun? There it is. A present from my mum. Vivian Westwood. I bloody love Vivian Westwood, you know. Anyway, look, it's got a little drawbridge. Vivian Westwood what? gorgeous and stunning and also my main present from my mum because i'm a loser adult now was a heated era you know if you want to hear more about my heated era tells you more immediately it's like a clothes era but there's heat but it's in heat excellent present actually that stops things smelling like a little moldy bottom and that concludes the things i have near me i got for christmas <laughs> my sister told me that videos where the thumbnail the person has their mouth open do better so goodbye forever